hello guys and welcome to a brand new video today i'm back with another fgo video so today i'll be reacting to um all the waltz costumes noble phantasms there is a video on it uh, of for it on youtube uh, i'm going to link the original video in the description box below so if you guys have not checked it out you can go and check it out and i'm going to react to this and now i know that uh, i think it's a, like a jp uh, event that came out recently of um uh like this the whole waltz i think there's a separate game which has uh i'm not sure about it but because of that game uh they like made some costumes and like it is was introduced in jp so now i one thing i am quite curious about is is it something like that you're only going to choose you'll only be able to choose only one costume or is it that everyone will get all the costumes that I'm, I'm quite curious about that like you know usually like in fgo like whichever costume gets introduced uh i've seen that if you have that servant you usually get it uh, for free kind of so i'm quite curious is it the same because i think there are a lot of uh, costumes that has been introduced because of the watch collaboration i think so i'm really curious so but i've not watched i've kind of like took a glimpse of the all the costumes i've not watched the end piece so like i'm going to do it now so yeah let's start this video and if you are interested in more of my fgo content uh, i'll be linking the playlist also in the description box and it will be somewhere over here so you can click on it and you'll find all the other fgo content that i did so without further ado let's get started with this video so i'll first watch the whole video and then i'll kind of go back and talk about my impressions on them so let's get started. All right, so here we go. Start. Oh, we have a mash costume first. All right. Oh, it's a cute costume. Okay, I'm guessing everyone will get mash costume for free. I'm sure about that. Because you know, Mashu is like the... I don't know, I'm just guessing. Okay, let's see. Oh, Helena! Okay, this is another cutesy type of a costume. Alright. Unfortunately, I don't have Helena. I have Helena Archer, but I don't have Helena Caster. Alright. Altera got the costume! Wow, Altera's costume is really... Wow, that's nice! Unfortunately, I don't have Alter as well. Okay, so the only the costume change. I thought there would be animation. Oh, this is Nito Chris. <laughs> wow, his her sprite is nice. You know that the the way she was kind of holding her cap. Okay, this is nice. Okay. Med got a costume. All right. Wow, Med looks a lot like you know those rich ladies, like those not Ojo Sama, yeah, kind of like an Ojo Sama. Okay. Oh, Serenity got a costume. Wow. I'm so happy. Okay, this is good. I'm so glad. Nice. Okay. Okay, Tamamo Cat. Wow, she looks like one of those <laughs> fast food um, employees. <laughs> okay, this is cute. Oh, Steno. Is this Steno? No, Zero L. Okay. Okay. Oh, Shutendoji. Wow. Nice. She she's like in a you know kind of like a traditional like Japanese yukata. I'm guessing that's. Oh, Jun Dr got her. Whoa. I have Jun Dr. So. Wow. Her her dress really look nice. Okay. 
牛ばっかうわお<笑> okay, I'm really looking forward to this event. It will be after two years, but you know, we'll have to wait for it. No! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Okay, is that the end? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's the end. Oh, wow, okay. I have a lot to talk about. First of all, the costumes that I loved the most. Ushiwaka Maru. She, she wins this, hands down. Like, I have to say, her costume, like, like, here it is. Her costume, it looks so good her hairstyle her face like i cannot like express like you know like this is the best costume i have to say like she looks amazing her even her hairstyle her like you know her facial expression kind of changed she's just smiling and then there's this kind of a dress i'm not sure what like what what this dress is but it looks good like you know i'm i'm not even sure if it it has some kind of a name you know or something i i don't know but it looks really good wow her costume is amazing if 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 it's like something like you can only choose one costume i'll definitely choose this one like this is amazing i have to say okay and after ushiwaka maru i would probably have to choose Jundi Arc's costume. Okay, just a sec. There she is. Now, this is my second favorite costume. Um, I don't know. Like, I really like the whole like the thing that she's you know wearing in her head. I'm not sure, but like it kind of resembles the thing that she usually wears. And um, then there's this like white dress, you know, and uh, the patterns in her dress are and and her. Uh, no, hair is also kind of braided. So it's really nice. Like her costume is my second favorite. I have to say. Um I kinda I thought that maybe the animation would also be kind of kind would also change along with the costumes, but that's not it, I think. I think it's only the costumes. So okay. Um Yeah. Oh okay, yeah. Usually like in FGO I'm kind of thinking, like as far as I can remember, none of the other costume changes had animation change. So yeah, like this is normal. So okay, I was kind of, you know, uh, kind of mixing FG up with another game. I was mixing this up with Honkai Impact. Like in Honkai Impact, the costume change changes comes with the changes in animations. So I kind of mixed it up. Okay. So yeah. Anyways. Mm, okay. So okay, these two are my favorites, and the third one that I really like. Okay, the third one that I like is a bit tough. You know. Hmm. I'll have to choose serenity like i really love her dress like look at it and even her sprite change you know uh, by sprite i mean uh, the 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 uh, what do you call it the portrait that we see like yeah here just like you can see it now um it's really nice like i don't know like why but like she has like a poisoned apple i'm guessing that is and three kunais so <laughs> it's nice and she has little flowers in her head and there's this like uh pink type of a dress she's wearing her hair is done really nicely you know and yeah i think this is my third favorite like the first one was ushiwaka second one uh john the arc third one is um serenity okay so after that the fourth one that i like is um I'm just checking which one is okay the fourth one I have to choose Merp like as a character I do not like Merp you know like she's quite neutral for me and where is her? okay there's a dress I usually do not like her as a character but her dress is really nice I have to say like it it like you know there's this she's wearing a uh, um small little crown and there's this like bangles in her hand she even even have has a like a little um bag a uh, handbag uh, what do you call that yeah that thing 
and her dress is full white and it has a really like you know city girl type of a vibe i think <laughs> okay this is my fourth favorite costume and uh, the next one i have to say i the fifth one is shuten doji's costume her costume it really is uh, like you know i think it's, this is yukata isn't it or a kimono I, uh, like i cannot differentiate between those two i don't know like you know what actually differentiates between them but i think kimonos are a bit flashy aren't they like is that it like the i'm not sure like i i have no idea about it kind of like i'm talking uh so like you can like let me know in the comment section if you want to so i don't know if this might, might be a yukata might be a kimono but i really like this you know like she has a little ornament in her head with a little Mm, what do you call it a thing a jewel or something i'm not sure and her her facial expression is really kind of like she has a little tattoo here and we can see her horn like you know her bangs kind of uh you know kind of parting and her horn kind of sticking out and her horn even has a little thing <laughs> okay and she is like her the design of the yukata or kimono is really nice it is like on a black black thing with uh, red or pinkish type of flowers and yeah this is good this is my uh, fifth favorite yeah uh, okay now the sixth one the sixth one i'll have to choose um, now this is a tough one okay i have to choose this sixth one as nero's costume like where is the costume i have to okay there you go wow her costume is kind of like i'm not sure like how to like you know describe this costume it looks like um i'm not really sure like it, it, i feel like you can see these type of co costumes in like if you go into some kind of carnival or something you know like i'm not sure but it, it looks like something like that he, she has like a um a, a, a bow or, or something like that on her, a hair ornament and her dress is uh green with a lot of uh, like you know designs uh, she has a little um what do you call it heart shaped um, ring and her sh she's even wearing uh, nail polish i think isn't she yeah red and her like her skirt is kind of like a little, has little smiley faces and there's number one written <laughs> with this l'oreal leaf you know and there's this so many things like so many ornaments and everything and it's nice she she has her hair done a, a little bit differently as well and as always her smile is elegant you know <laughs> uh, i really love nero as a character but her his costume is probably my sixth favorite one and uh, okay what is which one will i choose the next mm. okay the next one i'll have to choose where did it go um tamamo cat <laughs> okay that's uh, the seventh one isn't it the seventh one is tamamo cat's costume like nothing to, much to say like she's just wearing those you know like those uh, staff members those, those wearing those kind of foods uh, like fast food joints and the w waitresses i'm guessing and she's wearing that type of a dress with uh um like tamamo cat written here in the little thing uh, in her skirt and she has a cap and those like striped dress with a little bell and a little heart and i'm guessing it's like you know below that heart something's written i'm guessing it's like probably her name is written i'm not sure and she has the tray with the like things that the master is going to probably eat you know uh, a parfait i can see and a little cup i'm guessing coffee or something or tea whichever i'm, I'm guessing that's coffee and uh, yeah and as usual like she has the little paw and the tail you know uh, it's quite simple but it's not oh her um wait a minute her shoes have wheels in it wait is, is that it <laughs> this is like roller like you know roller skates or something i'm not sure <laughs> okay okay that's the seventh one um okay the eighth one i like is um altera i'll have to choose her um, her dress is okay what the 
okay there it is um so her dress is very simple i have to say um her face looks different she has a little thing here i'm guessing a rainbow colored thing and she's wearing a hair like you know uh, that thing that she wears and uh, like her dress is very simple a white colored you know dress and she has these kind of those tattoos that she has and yeah it's very simple and very like you know nothing much to say it's, it's a nice dress that I, that I have to say and yeah like it looks it looks elegant in a way okay so after this after Altera's costume I'll have to choose um which one okay like I've almost come to the end of it uh like Nitocris, Helena and Marsh is left I'll have to choose Nitocris's costume because like you know like like just a sec where is her costume wait a minute just a sec okay there you go um nothing much about her costume i really like her like the sprite that we are seeing now the design the portrait that we see now like her costume is not like you know it's okay but i really like the the way she's kind of posing you know like uh, holding her cap and we can see her face very clearly like she has like uh, a smile on her face and like the the tattoos that she usually has blue eyes and um you know like she like she's wearing uh i'm not sure how to mention this like uh i'm not actually sure what type of a dress this is it looks like uh i don't know but i've seen this type of dress a lot before like in animes and everything so she's got a little bow tie and uh like a little short little skirt with a little um red thing and uh, has nice shoes and a little gloves and like you know the thing that you wear in your hand and a little cap so yeah it's like it's cute i really like the way she is like you know posing and standing <laughs> that's what i really like about her uh, costume and after that i'll have to choose Marsha's costume i'm sorry but uh, i am not much big of a fan of this costume it looks cute but just a sec okay there you go it looks cute uh but that's just it you know like she has a little cap and uh what can i say like uh, this is just my preference you know like i'm not saying that this is bad like i do, do not prefer it that's what i'm saying like uh, comparing it to other costumes that's basically what i'm saying i know there's a lot of people who really like mesh and they'll probably like you know get angry or triggered at me saying that i don't like it so it's not that like i'm just saying that i prefer the other costumes more than her costume and she's like wearing a little um she has little pockets in her hand uh, those things like where you can keep stuff and her dress is it looks like i'm not actually sure like it looks like a dress where, where you would probably wear in like cold you know cold weather and something like it's all like you know covered up and everything and it's like looks like it's pretty warm i'm guessing so like in like places where it's like snowing or something i'm guessing you, you should probably you would probably wear something like this I'm not actually sure but it kind of reminds me of that so yeah and after Marshall's costume okay let me see if i missed something or not but then you rail the mamo hassan chris altera no and the last one is helena's dress um just a sec okay uh, there you go okay there you go helena's dress she her dress is cute that's just it like you know she has a little ha hat or cap what you, whatever you say and her dress uh, looks like uh, you know a, a red wrap type of a dress with uh, it's like, like a, a really cute type of a dress her hat like her cap even has some feathers in it with a little flower and uh, she has like striped uh, socks and yeah that's it so yeah this was like my like you know like how i preferred the um costumes like my ranking of the costumes i really liked uh, ushiwaka ushiwaka maru's costume is amazing if like you know if she like if if there's a thing like where they say that okay you will only have to i'm not sure like that's like one of my questions like are we are we only able to choose only one costume or everyone will get all the costumes like you know whichever servant you have the costume will get automatically 
I'm not actually sure. If it's something like that, that's that's great news. Like we'll probably get like I'll probably get like Nero's costume. I have Nero, Ushibaka's costume, Jundi Arc I'll get, um, Urail I'll get, Tamamo Cat, Hassan of Serenity, um, Nito Chris, and uh, Masha. These costumes I'll get if it is something like that. But if you have to choose only one, you know, if it's something like that. Then I'll definitely choose Uchiwaka Maru's costume. Even though I do not use much of Uchiwaka Maru, I love her costume so much. It looks so amazing. So, yeah. So, that was it, guys. That was this, um, my reaction to the, all the, not technically noble phantasms, but the costumes in a way. So, I really liked it. And, like, I have to say, like, um, this, like you know this is amazing like it's like so many costumes at the same time we're getting if we are getting i'm not sure if we're getting going to get all of it but you know like so many costumes are introduced at the same time uh, in the jp server obviously so the bad news is we'll have to wait <laughs> for two years i'm guessing because it's a re really recent uh, event so i'm guessing it's like or usually the jp is uh, ahead by two years so we'll have to wait two years so yeah two years We'll have to wait. So <laughs> that's the only bad news we have. So yeah, I, I I've made my decision. Ushiwaka Mom's costume is definitely the best. So thank you guys for watching. This was my reaction to all the watch costumes, Noble Phantasm. I'll be linking the original video down in the description box. Be sure to check it out if you haven't. And uh, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed my reaction to this video, be sure to press the like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Please be sure to subscribe because that will really make me happy. I'm trying to increase my sub count, so that will also help me. And comment down below if you want to say anything. Your like which which costume you like the best, or you know like uh, and all of those things. Uh, so I'll be look at like you know I'll uh, check out all the comments that you guys uh, uh, write. So yeah guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next week with another FGO related video. So until then, goodbye and have a nice day.